Yo, 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 what is going on guys, it is your boy Aptic Scumpy bringing you another ghost gameplay commentary here today using the Honey Badger with extended clips, obviously the silencer is integrated into it already, but this gameplay was pretty sick, I end up going like 32 and 3 or something, and that's weird because in Cranked, if you don't go on that initial first spree, it's very, very, very difficult to actually drop a KM strike just because of how quickly the games go, how the points add up, two kills... I mean, one kill is two points, and there's only 100 points in a game whenever you're cranked, and it's one point whenever you're not cranked. But still, that's not a lot. And whenever you're on a streak like that, if you get 25 kills, that's literally 50 points for your team. Well, 49, I guess, because of the initial kill. But it's really, really difficult to get if you don't go on, the, on that initial spree, like I said. So, this was a pretty sweet game. You can see I get taken out there. But some guy last night came at my neck and said that, it takes you four hours to get a gameplay, and then that makes you look good, which sort of baffled me. Um, if I wanted, you know, to get gameplays that were, like, superb, like, outstanding, um, and only post, like, crazy, crazy gameplays on my channel, then that would be that. I would spend a lot of time getting gameplays, uh, and not really as much time competing in tournaments and, you know, getting better as a competitive player, which is my primary uh, goal is to get better as a competitive player before public matches. Obviously, public matches are fun, but uh, learning those is a lot easier than actually learning the ins and outs of competitive. So, to shut him up, basically what I did, I tweeted at him and I said, it took me 45 minutes to get three gameplays. I only got one KEM in that set of gameplays, but I ended up going like 28-2 and two in one game, like 27-1 and one in another one, and I actually just went 31-1 and one in a game before I actually recorded this video, and we're playing in a 2K tournament on game battles all day today so I'll be streaming after my videos get published if we're still in the tournament um, I think we play complexity next which is you know the juggernaut of Call of Duty competitive right now so it's gonna be a good game we're playing with a pickup team uh, it's me Nate shot Spacely and huddle so we're looking to do big things there but I was it just baffled me because you know it really doesn't take me that long to get uh, public match gameplays and I'm not bragging in any sense um, you know, however long it takes people to get their gameplays, it takes them however long. Sometimes I can't even get gameplays because I'm just not in the zone, I'm not in the mood to play, you know, things like that. There's a lot of variables, but whenever I'm in the zone and I'm ready to play, I can get gameplays pretty easily. So, fuck that guy! But I, I know he was probably just kidding. He got a lot of hate because I tweeted at him and put the periods in front so all my followers could see. But yeah, a little bit about this gameplay. Um, basically, I just go off here. I don't really know what else to say other than that. The Honey Badger is an absolute beast. I never really gave it a fair chance until last night. And um, it really is a great gun to use. Uh, the range on it is really, really good, even though it has a silencer. Uh, sometimes you have to tap it to get the range, to get your recoil good, because, you know, the range is sometimes a little bit shaky. But um, it's a really, really good hybrid. It feels like an SMG, but it's an AR. So I can oh snipe people God, with it. Scumpy. It's really ridiculous. And right here we have somebody in the game that actually knew who I was. So dropping a KEM on someone that knew who I was is that much more rewarding. Because they're obviously gunning for my neck the whole time. But yeah, if you haven't given the Honey Badger a chance, uh, definitely try it out. Throw extended mags on it and the grip is what I'm using in this gameplay. And uh, hopefully you can do big things with it. But you're going to see me get the KEM strike right here. I was begging that my team didn't end the game. I was like praying, like, oh please God. don't end the game. Because uh, as you can see, 96, and then it goes up to 99 with zero seconds left on my KEM, and then it gets dropped. So I hope you guys enjoyed this gameplay and commentary. If you did, like, favor, con comment, subscribe. As always, this was your boy Optic Scumpy. Uh, you're going to see the scoreboard here in a second. 32 and 3. What's good?